here's a look at the explanation between a few different types of precipitation we see during winter. I had a lot of questions about it, so we built this graphic yesterday, kind of explaining what the difference between snow, sleet, freezing rain, and rain are. First off, during winter, when we have higher base clouds, most everything starts precipitation wise in the form of snow. It's frozen material. And snow, that continues to stay frozen because it's in a cold air path all the way down to the ground. With sleet, you start to see a little bit of a warmer layer that kind of bends in to that pathway, melting the snow just for a bit. It, but still enough time for that snow to refreeze into small ice pellets. That's why sleet sometimes will bounce as it hits the ground. It's a little icier and sturdier. As for freezing rain, which was the big question yesterday, what is freezing rain? Starting off as snow moving to that warm air path, a little longer falling into the warm air path keeps it as liquid form until it hits the surface. Just enough time in the very cold air and cold surface that will freeze upon impact with the surface of something like a roadway leading to black ice. And with rain, something that we'll see even into summer, well, we have cold air up in the upper atmosphere. That warmer air is all the way down to the surface, meaning that as the snow melts, it stays melted, and you see that precipitation in the form of rain.